Feature Friday. The freshest. <laughs> Filipino singers that went viral in 2020. Oh, this nice. is an updated version. Since we watched the last one that was like went viral like a couple a few years back. Right, right. So you guys sent me a a compilation that's way Data. more uh, uh, updated. And um, yes, apparently this is just as crazy as the one we watched. And we have found out that a lot of the some of actually not a lot some of the people that we watched in the previous compilation, uh, you know, now have an audience online, or some some of them are singing const- uh, consistently. So this is interesting to see they've just gone viral, right? So yeah. Basically, a, you know, less than a year ago. So yeah. let, let, let's give this a go. Plenty of food then. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's what I enjoy. I loved her hair, by the way. Yeah, she looked She's great. Got beautiful she looked great. Hair. They all have good hair. Yeah. Can can we can we have a hair care routine? Is that a teacher? I think it is. She's got like maths. Bad Trinidad. Trinidad, Trinidad. Isn't it? Trinidad. Yeah, I don't have to say it in English. I don't wanna lose you. I don't wanna lose you. Just to have somebody by yeah, turn it up, turn it up. And I don't want to hate you oh, it's gorgeous. I don't want to take you But I so don't really want to be the one to cry Ephra, imagine having that a class Walking into your lesson And your singer, your teacher's doing that To anyone anymore It's beautiful But like a fool And I keep seeing you walk through the door wow. But there's a danger in love somebody too much Oh, it's beautiful! And it's sad when you know it's your heart you can trust There's a reason why people don't stay where they are Maybe sometimes love just ain't enough very charming Bravo! Bravo! Freaking beautiful! If I could never change you, it's I like don't want to blame back. you. Baby, you don't have to take the fall. Yeah, I wish my singer sang like this. Yes, I may have hurt you, but I did not deserve you. Maybe I just want to have it all. It's just so good. It makes us out under. She doesn't know the lyrics, huh? she's just like learning as she goes. It makes me feel like a wreck. But she's so familiar with the song already yeah. though. And like a fool who will never see the truth. I keep thinking that something's gonna change. But it's just but there's beautiful. a danger of loving somebody too much. And it's sad when you know it's your heart. You can trust. There's a reason why it's very attractive people too. It's so charming. It's incredibly charming. Baby, sometimes love just ain't enough. So much warmth in her natural capacity. And no way home when it's late at night and you're all alone. Oh my God, here we go. Are the things that you wanted to say? This is my father and I like playing. This is like... This is like a freaking... Calle del Hambre. They're just chilling on... Okay, what is yeah, a Calle del Hambre? It's a, it's a, it's a, food, it's a, it's a food street, yeah? But basically, stop saying yeah. Which basically... I have a thing with people that say yeah after every sentence. I know. And it's turned out I've turned into the thing that I hate the most. <laughs> Bloody hell. You haven't agreed yet, have you? No. Anyways, but the... The thing is, there's these food streets in Venezuela in yes. which they're all food stands. stands. Yes. Street food stands. Hygiene may not be the highest. You're not there for the hygiene value. You're there for the food yes. and the taste and the variety of sauces and brilliant condiments that they can put <laughs> in these fantastic and mouth-watering delicious hot dogs. <laughs> that is fun. That you can't get anywhere else. No. But in Venezuela like that. Yes. So anyways. 
That is so accurate. <laughs> this food streets, which I miss daily. <laughs> for sad, actually. I, I miss them too. <laughs> no one else makes hot dogs like that. No, or no, burgers no. like that. Everyone or food like that. You don't get, like, you get some Yes, you may cool. get salmonella. Grow up. <laughs> <laughs> Nothing a few days of bad diarrhea can get off. <laughs> sure. <laughs> you think, I'm joking, I'm joking. It's, uh, it's, it's actually, uh, but it's like... um. It doesn't even have like stands. It's like trucks. It's food trucks. That's, Sometimes they just the cars park. Like yeah, they're just parked in this road. And um, yeah, it looks like this. Yes. And people do have sometimes karaoke. Videokies, Some people like yeah, 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 stuff like, stuff like that. But they they never are this this good. No, no, back home <laughs> they suck like hard. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Very, very badly. It's just more like for bit, the entertainment bit value. Yeah. Just yeah. Sort of, drinking and stuff yes so you very rarely can get a moment like and this. one of the great perks about that the street back home is is that it's always there like all night yep. no matter the weather and you will always like the, the trucks like they they change because they're obvious trucks so they they're always like different food, in different places in yeah. different places and whatever but um yeah the is always there especially in the weekends well, always used to be there. I don't know what it's like now, but it used to be like that. It's so the equivalent of when you go clubbing in London, if you're watching from London or England. It's like kebab shops. Kebab shops and chicken shops. It's but the they're there like... But I believe these ones are way better because they're actually... You get variety as well. No, and, it, and it's just made... It's cheaper as well, way yeah. cheaper. And it's just nasty. Like It's it lovely. It's good. It's, it's yeah, good. Yeah. Anyway, so let's watch this. It has that environment. It looks like that, yeah. She has great hair. Fantastic, it's beautiful. It's like a neighborhood. <laughs> I like the senora. <laughs> Lots of power, yeah. What makes them learn these songs? 
They're not even popular songs. Maybe they are. Like, they're old though, like... How do they discover they can do this, like... <laughs> Girl, what on earth? That was insanity. It's just awesome. Somebody, please. My God. That's interesting. How did she learn that? Of course. So, that, actually, maybe now. I'm starting to understand, right? So, one of the things that you, if you probably saw ballet, she's probably doing this thing, right? Uh, one of the things that could be one of the skills that they pick up right naturally through practice and through karaoke. It's obviously mm -hmm. distance control with the mic, mm -hmm. right? Something you only learn in life or oh, through karaoke. Actually, I never yeah. thought of that for some reason. Um, well, it's not. It's not a uh, something that we see often here. So true, true. So those mics suck, trash, because um, you don't you're not doing it to sell tickets. You're the doing speakers, it for fun. the speakers are awful. Terrible as well, <laughs> and they saturate. But actually, great way of learning how to modulate, how to know accuracy, how to mm -hmm. distance control, breath control, and power. Like how not to grab notes like a motherfucker, right? Mm -hmm. It's that. It's just crazy though. How do they? How? Because the like I learned those 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 things through people telling me this is how you do it. Right. Uh, how do they get like? I I just don't understand it. It's like. They listen to the songs and they try to replicate them and they, they I don't know somehow they figured out that by doing this or moving in a certain way or if if I you know lean back instead of leaning forward it actually reach higher notes clear, I, clear like yeah. that to me that to me it's like it's a big puzzle like you you guys really baffle me this, this is incredible <laughs> and you can tell you know there's very little coaching involved yes right so it it's like what the f it just it's just like know. everything is against them in this type of environments and they're absolutely killing that's it. That's why those shows, I understand, right? The more I watch this type of stuff, that's why those shows are like X Factor and the Philippines, The Voice Philippines, are so attractive over there and mm. so popular. I'd say more popular than they are here. Yes, actually. There, there was a moment where here, there, it was obviously your Britain's Got Talent, it was just Britain. Um, but it's because it, there is an appeal, right? Of There is so much talent and they know this now. There's so much talent in the streets. Of Manila in the streets of, of, of the, the whole of Philippines, the whole of Philippines, little little uh, little islands, towns, the little towns, little moments, you know. Yeah. Um, so the the fact that there are shows like that where you can be seen by your idols or and uh, given a platform is such an appealing and people really then build a relationship to these uh, uh, artists and the kids, like especially the the kids, right? So it, I'm starting to understand more and more of it, you know. It but it's fantastic. what's on. What's not very clear. It's yes. It doesn't. It's not very. Uh, it's just not it, very logical. I was gonna say there's no really logical explanation for it all. It, yeah, how they pick this stuff up? Like, it really fuck. is baffling to me. A reggae. Ooh, let's yeah, go. Get a keyboard.
Yes, yes. I know someday it all turn around because all my life I've been waiting for, I've been praying for, for the people to say so that we close. don't want to fight no more. There'll be no more wars when our children we play. One day, one day, one day. <laughs> it's not about to win or lose Cause we all lose when they beat them Souls of the innocent plastics baby Keep on moving to the one that's there For bookings now, yeah, call literally, here man, just put Literally, your, just where put your is email. your phone number? Where can we get you to sing weddings? Like, yeah. that is it yeah. they got, Those guys got it down They, they do. got it down They're He's all... a performer Naturally, he's there enjoying the moment. They probably, yeah, they do it for fun or whatever. But and someone sent me that. There's like, for sometimes just people do it for fun. I'm like, yeah, wouldn't you like to earn money through fun? <laughs> wouldn't you? you, know you what I mean? Wouldn't you want to have more fun? Yeah. <laughs> it get, yeah, it gets more fun the bigger it goes. You know what I mean? Well, actually, it comes with its responsibilities. It does, too, but, I... but it's also under your control. That's one of the things. Mm. As long as you stay independent. And you decide what you want to... I want to perform here, maybe. Or how many gigs you want to do. You can take... We know bands here. Close bands. And all around South America. That do it for fun. But they do it for fun in front of 100 people. 200 yeah. people. And there's money involved. And it turned into a great hobby. And it's a great experience. But they don't want to be famous. They don't want any of that stuff. They just like just, to perform just like doing in front music. of people. And, you know, their cash. It's always, it always helps. <laughs> It's you know always I mean? nice. Yeah, so it's a nice reward. <laughs> I understand that comment and I, I agree with it. Maybe there is a true passion of... Just music and singing. Yeah, and I look at it as well like through sport, right? Because that, that's what I've dedicated my life to in the last 10 years. It, not everyone you meet, even if they're really talented, they want to go pro. That's true. Or they want to earn money through or they want to coach or they want... Mm -hmm. They just love playing. You know? I know, and that's but fine. It, it, is, it, it, it has a totally different perspective when, when you're somebody like us that sees it from 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 the other side of the spectrum who's like people that have been involved or in 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 those parts of it and you see people with this talent and you know how lacking the industry is of those type of talents and it makes you question everything you know about life it's like really <laughs> i just i just hope i just hope they really do know and they do get told how and they do believe because i i believe a lot of these people get told you're really good but then they maybe don't believe it Yeah, you know, yeah, or yeah. maybe like, yeah, I'm good, but I couldn't do, you know, I, I just really do hope that uh, so they know that they're good watch. and that there is something there. That you just be watering on that plan and something great could happen. Because there's something as well that, that happens a lot is you get these artists that do maybe post videos or do stuff for fun, but they never received or they never believe the feedback that they receive of actually I could make something out of this or actually I am all right. Yeah, you know, they they just think nah, I'm not that good, or you know what I mean. It's yeah, yeah. whatever. It's the curse of the artist, right? It, you know what it I mean? is. It, it really is. But I really do hope, and maybe if anyone of them is watching this, that they do know, they're good. <laughs> It's impressive. They're good. Truly impressive. They're good. I really like this dude.